from you hear that song, you know what time it is. It is time for Talk the Ting with Kim. And I'm your host, Kimmy Kim Kim. So for this week, our topic, or discussion will be about online dating. A blessing or a curse? I want to think about that because I want to boy. I'm sure the answers are quite divided with this one because <laughs> some may see it as a blessing and some definitely will call it a curse. But we're going to get more into that as the show progresses. As I said, guys, it is the start of December. So you're going to be seeing the Christmas hat. You know, every show in December, I will have this hat. If you don't see, you know, I'm going to lift it. We'll see if you get But that's the intention. So let me start that from here. Jump but yeah, bag from now. don't it? As my girl was putting in the bag mm-hmm. and can't go work and everything all week until next week Friday. Big up to Dre on the IG live. Yes, big up Dre and anybody else that is on the Instagram live. And for all you out there in Radio Land, big up on yourself as well. I hope that you've either gotten home safely. Yo, we hear said traffic rough. But yeah, so we're going to get into the conversation. Online dating, a blessing or a curse. Before we even go into the content that I prepared, what do you guys personally think? Is it a blessing or a curse? Online dating, really? Yeah. Um, well, I'd say, all right, if you want to put it on, like, where on the scale it belongs, it's falling more nowadays over to the to the curse side of the scale. Uh-huh. I think it's not really unlike, you see, like, just like, oh, I think the other last couple of days we've been talking about, like, social media. Yeah. We've been talking about technology. Yeah. And not really technology and social media are the problem, you know, a people are the problem. True. Because it can be such a great thing, but there are so many side effects and little things that people go around the system with mm-hmm. online that, you know, sets us back and make people upset or put people at an inconvenience. Yeah. Well, you see, that's, I love that you pointed that out because all of these things that we're going to start creating or the creation itself is not a bad yeah, thing, you know. Really it's just how it's manipulated yeah. or used. So online dating, ah, I won't give my feedback yet, so we're going to get into the content. So internet dating services were introduced in the 1990s and more and more serious love connections have since come out of them. Today... Tinder alone matches 26 million people every day. Some people have excellent experiences with online dating that end in satisfying relationships. Others have stories filled with confusion and frustration. Thus, much like any other way to date, meeting someone online has both benefits and drawbacks. So there are some questions that I was asked as well by listeners who were very interested in this content. So one of the questions that was shared with me is, is it possible to gauge through an online conversation if a person has chemistry with you or not? No. Right? So why would you say no? Because there was the, there was a thing that I, I had seen, was it earlier today, I believe? And the lady was talking about her experience with dating. Yeah. So she met him in person, actually. But her experience in dating this individual, everything was gauged on a ding. Mm-hmm. So with with how he spoke, and he didn't have to put much effort into going out with her, into taking her out. Because that's a part of dating. You must go out on yeah. dates to know what this is like, to know who, he, who you're talking to, get to know them a little bit better. And she said that, she said that, you know, everything was gauged with a message of a ding, with a notification. She yeah. looked forward to it. To the ding. To the ding. To and the sound, the, to the, the right. sound that comes in when you get a message or a response. Or and she said, with that, she lost focus of what the actual relationship was or what it should have been about. Mm-hmm. And you cannot gauge with how. You cannot gauge how someone will respond. So if somebody is upset about something, they mm-hmm. prefer you call them and mm-hmm. talk to them or meet up with them face to face. Yeah, well, it's, it's so, said anytime having uncomfortable or serious conversation, conversation it's right. always best to do that in person, yeah, right? Texting is always rough for those things and, and online messaging and emailing. Exactly. Yeah. But as the question says, you know, if it's possible to gauge through an online conversation if a person has chemistry with you or not. So... Some research was done on this, and it said that two main indicators point us towards or away from a person. They are body language and vibes. Mm-hmm. Them two something. You know, everybody loves to the energy. Yeah. You know, like, oh, okay. the same as the so vibes. that is the vibes, right? Or the body language. 
So body language includes facial expressions, tone of voice, eye contact, and how a person moves his or her head on their neck and shoulders. Yes, that deep. Their their hands and arms over their face or chest or even how they position themselves when they're standing, stuff like that. That's what catches out a person. You know, you see somebody, you like them walk. Or you like them have a little swag to them. Or, you know, them like for them put themselves together. Stuff They're like that. so neat. Right? Them just neat. Or I the way them just, they just carry an aura like. with them. So that is that can be considered the body language. Then vibes, on the other hand, other hand, isn't as tangible, right? These are just signals a person sends. And they are differently perceived by various people. Come here, you can look on the same person. Mm-hmm. And me, I say, oh my God, I'm just seem like, yeah, I'm just and I'm like, the room. And you're like, huh? Uh, Are we looking at the same people here? All right. Different interpretation of body language. You okay? And, and vibes and energy, right? Because you know, somebody will say, boy, we can't stand the first night. You're like, why? And you then know? sometimes, or, or, or first, what do I call it now? Impression. First impression might have effect on the vibes. Yeah, you see true. the guy stepping out, you see the girl stepping looking at her and beautiful. And full of themselves. Ah, when she <laughs> not give no attention up here, no my ear. She's looking at me. She's <laughs> giving me a, she's looking at her. She just, she just waved. I went on a you get back Exactly. There? You're just caught up in the whole excitement. Yeah, so one could describe vibes as good, cheerful, and pleasant, or mm-hmm. dark, uneasy, and negative. Gloomy. Negative vibes. We know that in Jamaica. But no, negative vibes. Too nice. Too nice. In yeah. an online conversation, especially one that does not involve using a live camera, mm-hmm. it is impossible to read a person's body language. Still, you mm-hmm. can feel a person's vibe. Mm-hmm. You can feel if they are funny, upbeat, serious, or dull. Sometimes you cannot find an adjective to describe a person's vibes. You can just feel uneasy or at ease. So, you know, like, oh, as Jamaican, we love to say, boy, I'm a spirit. Just, we don't know why. Just, just not take them. I'm a spirit. Just not take you. So, it's like, we can't even describe it, but we just feel a uneasiness, you know, or we just, for some reason, just can't be comfortable around that person. Be warned. Do not let vibes fool you. Some people are way more pleasant and attractive online than in real life. She's not talking about cartel. <laughs> Other than vibes, there are little pointers that would either repel you away from the conversation or draw you in further. For example, a person's written language. Mm. The way a person strings a sentence together tells a lot about how he or she thinks, you his are... or her education, and their level of attention to detail. Cause you know them people all type foolishness and them not correct it now. Them just know say you know what we are talking about. Yeah, that's And true. they have some people that no matter that them will say it uh, two days ago you get a random notification where you check it. It's a message you already read, but they just edited it, right? So you have some people who pay very keen attention to detail. I am those people. Those people are me. <laughs> if it wrong, it wrong, and it's staying that. I way. just say that way. Yeah. Now the the type of questions that persons ask. The ease and flow of the conversation, the level of eagerness to get to know you, and the speed at which he or she responds to your messages. Uh These are all pointers along the way that make you know whether you should really continue with this or not. It's quite common on online dating applications such as Tinder to meet many people. It is smart to have many conversations going at once. Well, Actually, it's quite, this is another question, so sorry. Way, this is another question that I had gotten as well. So it's quite common on online dating applications such as Tinder to meet many people. Is it smart to have many conversations going at once or should you only pick a few people to talk to? Mm. What do you think before well, I, I give the answer? It, it depends on what your definition of the. All right, is. let's go with Carty Shakespeare. Carty Shakespeare said, online, first of all, is a no-no for me. <laughs> <laughs> so she not look no blue <laughs> man online. So Carty said, I don't feel sure that. Right? MV, so like him, my feedback. MV, what do you think about the online mm. dating thing? And do you think you should talk to several people at once or you should narrow it down to a few? Hmm. As Jada said, it depends on your... Um, definition of dating. Yeah. And 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 what your goal is. Right. So if your goal is to um well then again, I guess everybody's goal is to find somebody. Exactly. Else. But I mean it depends on the type of person that you are, I would say. Mm-hmm. But so if you hold on, if you know. if you are like me, who will start mixing conversation mm-hmm. and, and I can't keep track. Yeah, and then <laughs> and then 
call that one year. Well, the name, the name thing probably. Yeah, that's true. Sure. But mm-hmm. you probably start mix up certain things, mix mm-hmm. up. Are the are the, the information they shared right. with you? The one like strawberry ice cream, but the other one like vanilla. Vanilla. I yeah, say, so yeah, I'm buy some vanilla. You're like, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. You have this, if you're like me, you're going to want to stick to just a few. A few. Uh-huh. So I think it depends on that. But I mean, I mean, I personally don't like online dating apps mm-hmm. because it, it mental health reasons. Okay. It, yeah. It, it comes it, draining. Yeah. And and it have a thing where it, it um, I don't remember exactly how it worked, but it's like a thing where you, you constantly get your hopes up. And then drop it back down because... Uh, well, we know why you go too much into that because that might be a part of my content, right? <laughs> yeah, I so, mean... Uh-huh. Um, for, for, that, for that element as well, as I say, most of the thing is really with people and why I use the app, you know? Because people are really considerate about that. Some use it for fun, some are games, some are waste of time, you know? So that part comes into play. But if you're talking about messaging more than one person or a lot of person, really and truly, if you find that you're on a dating app, and you're interested in not 10 people at one time. No, you're dating on a few. <laughs> you're definitely not interested in a dating. Yeah. You either yeah, have yeah. other means or other interests in mind. I just want a conversation. Exactly. Mm-hmm. 10 people? No, no, no. But So it's basically usually generally understanding that you're going to pick three, four, five. You know, let's say at most probably six or seven. But if you, if you talk to the whole of the app, People up on the app one time, something wrong with it. But Mura say it depends because if you can, why not? No, but well, then you're not. What are you looking for? Yeah, go on, narrow down. Just to talk narrow to down. Say, yeah, go on, narrow down. So if you can't narrow down, why you need to talk to 10 to narrow down? You can't narrow down. It's you like somebody has summarized, that. and if I summarize from 6,000 words, I summarize to 6,000, I'm um, to 5,990. Okay. No. Understand you get what I'm saying? Understand yeah. the point. But so you have to be able to pick out. Because mm-hmm. you see these apps now, they give you a chance to basically pass people. You don't have to respond to somebody. You get what I'm saying? Well, those are some of the yeah. things that will be highlighted so, as well. So Take your time and focus, man. Three, four, five people, because trust me, as MV, so when I start to talk to 10, 15 people, <laughs> you have to tell someone and say, yo, last night we talked about the movie. You scroll up when you look enough for that chat there. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? So, yeah, just, yeah, just be good to yourself. I'll take a time to talk to people, yeah. Well, in response to the question, uh, research shows that it is normal to start talking to several people at the same time. But as the number and the quality of the conversations increase, it would be hard to continue juggling mm-hmm. unless you are not serious about dating. Ta-ta-da! Just like hey. in real life, <laughs> some people enjoy being elusive and mm-hmm. keep as many options as open like as them. possible mm-hmm. in the online world. Mm-hmm. Some people just enjoy chatting and flirting with no serious end in mind. Mm-hmm. There is no absolute right and wrong advice when it comes to the number of conversations you are having. But it is only ethical to avoid leading people on and promising things you cannot deliver. But the card says, you are eyeglass, man, I have 10 feel. Exactly. And I talk to 10, 15, 20 people one Why time. Not? Hey, you. Hey, you. Be here, you widow. Hey, big head. Exactly. No, no. <laughs> What's up? I like dating no widow, be hey, big head. Yeah, that's that's people you know. People you see personally as that date. They're going to not just hey, online you. conversation. Hey. Yeah. Well, another question that I was asked is, when is it okay to go on an actual date? with someone you met online. Four and, months. Well, for this one, it does not matter if you yeah, go on a yeah. date. Four <laughs> months. That four months, you probably married a person the black side. Yeah. Well, four months, you go on a date. It does not matter if you go on a date right away or after a few chats. There is no correct timing to take an online relationship to the real world. Having said that, let me warn you that people online are not the same as when you meet them in real life. That's what I'm going to say. A smooth online chat can be the exact opposite when you meet them in person. My advice is to meet a person you met online as soon as possible to avoid disappointment and emotional traps. Mm-hmm. The worst emotional trap is falling in love with the online version of a person, the phone version. So they talk every day, oh my yeah. God. This person is so sweet, and for months now, I talk and say, All right, we're gonna meet up, and then it's like a whole different energy. You wonder if you even knew the person, you know? So we fall in love with a version of the person, and then it turns out that we're not able to even like them in real life. I've, I've literally done this. Like, I remember meeting someone online, uh, 
and we would talk and conversations were decent to be fair you know they were decent on the phone and i was like all right and he invited me out and i was like mm, all right okay it's a good vibe so far went on the date guys and it was a lot of like i had to finding things to talk about Cause, all right, so it was like a q a and I was the person right. providing the questions, right. and it was stressful. Because I was going to tell you, Kimmy, no, Maybe some of these so online pretty. conversations that you're having, they have, they have their cliff notes on the side. <laughs> yeah, they have our their team, Google searches our on team the side. on the background, I help or you, they right. Have, they have, I, I, I saw this one time where this brother just start copying and paste messages across chats. Yeah. So the yeah. first, like, probably four girls will get the same message. Hey, how you doing? I saw your eyes looking beautiful. I said, brother, you didn't even look if the girl have eyes. Like, <laughs> bro, copy our piece, right? So, trust well, yeah, me. Look on the the eyes. Come no, out. come on, Jada, equality. For <laughs> Everybody needs to know. But I'm just saying, like, at the end of the day, some of these persons, as you say, you're relating to them online, that might not be their vocal person. So, before you go on the date, I suggest mm, you have to message first. No, so as I'm Based saying, for us, we were messaging for yeah. a bit, you know. It wasn't like, like yes, no. Overall. The, 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 you said the, the, the yeah, here yeah, were the messaging research for a bit. Says, the, research, the research says, as soon as, as, possible, soon as possible. But I don't want person to misconstrue that. Yeah, in a given step. In a meter so tomorrow. Talk first. <laughs> then, then you go to like a voice phone conversation. Yeah. Then you try to go to a video conversation. Do you like each other enough? Then you go to a video conversation. Then you take it to in-person. Don't try to go in-person without cutting off those two steps first. But you should try. I said try because in-person, when you go out in-person on dating with these people, you've met online. Mind, remember that you don't know them. Mm -hmm. You're going to know them, to meet them, to see if you're, you know, we're going to gel for real. So, send location. It's my thing. Safety. Well, we, have, we, we have, yeah, we have that safety point safety. out. That's my first we have that point out. So don't and then Cardi yes. Shakespeare. We don't know what Cardi Shakespeare throwing at somebody with this part. Not to mention seeing the person without makeup. Uh, which guy you have without makeup, Cardi Shakespeare? Which guy you have beat? No, but you what, see? What, well, we never talk about makeup. So. We're talking about the pictures, though. Because that's why, that's why I said do the video call first. Wait, so that's why I'm getting into my content before we get into it. Yes, no, I didn't ask yes, this one. Oh, so we're going on the date. No, I, I, tell you, oh, so. I didn't ask us this one. I, I did it and I can rise and get into the content. All right. So we're going to stick up in. Exactly. All right. But MV say one to yeah, add no, something. No, no, regarding the conversation thing. Mm. Conversations can be difficult nowadays, you know, because there's a particular formula to having a conversation with a stranger that you're trying to get to know. Yeah. However, you can... You can forget that formula occasionally because of the day and age of um, information because your brain are full up with so many different things online and uh, we are watch so many videos and, and stuff. You can genuinely forget how to um, pull certain conversation. And I don't think that was the case. <laughs> because it's trying to be. Because it's trying to be. All right. no, I get what you're trying to Sometimes, get at, yeah. but I think overall, People develop this level of comfort behind a screen, yeah. right? And whilst people are less shy, you you meet very shy people who are very brazen in them typing, right? Yes, they will say stuff they would never say to you in person they live, because they live there behind. is a screen. Yeah, a yeah. So they have that confidence and the aura and everything, but that's not really them. Mm -hmm. So now the minute you know get into in, in not forgetting how to have a conversation, mm -hmm. it is now removing this. It's such a it's such a video call, your, the shield your mask, your shield. and the mask, right? Yeah. So now it's in front of each other where I'm not only listening to what you're saying, I'm actually observing you. I make eye contact. I say, yeah. oh, you're probably lean or if you look like you watch but everybody run with her. To Kimmy. But that's the a voice point. took us. Some people, I, when them, them I say, oh, I'm not, I'm, like when them talk, yeah. they're like, you doing? You doing? Them talk soft. Yeah. But when they have a message, come on. You mess mind, a very different person. So it's not that they've forgotten it. It's just that there's more elements to consider. Mm -hmm. So even your attire, because not that yeah. we've been on a date, you're interested. You look good at River Ray. So even that, no, you're a priest. I'm wondering if I'm um, here. Yeah. All right. Yeah. I let's take a yellow. I have your three best pictures up already. So you can't do that. <laughs> like, that's exactly. you on the beach? You're like, yeah, of course that's me on the, the beach. The online profile, when love that you swim. pointed that out. You selected you have the best version yeah. of you and you put that out and that's what the person kept. When you go in person, you're nervous. Yeah. Like, yeah. nervous. Exactly. No, but nervous is one thing and that was fine. But as I said, it was like, it's at no difference. point. It's it was a difference. whole different. And I was like, no, this is not me. <laughs> I cannot do this. <laughs> and then, no. You see, usually though, in, the, in those situations, as I say, you're probably meeting for the first time. That should also help you 
to see how well each of you, because I think ladies usually put the effort on the man, and then man usually say, boy, if the lady not give me a vibe, we don't have to feel nothing, right? But trust me, both of you have to figure out a way to break the ice. I it's was not breaking one the person's ice, man. responsibility. I was... I was breaking the yeah, whole but that's what I'm saying. So, so if the ice breaking doesn't bring you guys together <laughs> a little bit, then you know so it's going to be rough down the end. Because trust me, one person should realize, oh, that person is interested to read, so they try to have a conversation with me here and kind of relax. I bet say, I say you don't ask me close in the Where's the no, what? Oh, yes, I no question. No, no, <laughs> no. no. We're not going to that, right? You, you like to play cricket? You know me long yeah. enough. <laughs> we're not going to ask you like bread. You watch no. TV? <laughs> yes. Right? <laughs> I had proper conversations. Yes. But it's just that you'd expect questions to be asked yeah. back. And that's it all wasn't even that oh. either. So it was like a cue. It was like literally, like me and you, with a station, and me and interview of a final of how you do it. That's, and every time you answer, you're like, okay, yeah. That, so I did that today. That's one of my reasons for coming off. All right, um, so what well, else you did? Oh, um, and I also did that after. That's one of my reasons for coming mm. off. Okay. In 2020, mm. me try out the, 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 the online dating thing. And that, me come out with it about three months. Because me say, you know, hey, you know, see you do that, 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 that. Yeah, bam. No question back. You know, look, really, nothing yeah. like that. I just, me a chew. And I chew. Exactly. And get tired. Yeah. You get me, I say? <laughs> At some point, the person, you get me, I say? And then, see them, you know, worst, 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 what I say, the worst test part of it. Me, they are go about me, dear. And that person come and say, hey, I was hey, what's up? No, uh Boom. <laughs> Conversation done. <laughs> you know, and you say, hey, to me, you, know, you must have come with something. So them, them look at everybody and say, yeah, well, this is not for me. Because there's no way somebody will come say, hey, to me. I you never have the next learn, idea in mind. Learn about conversation. No. I no, done MV, before. I don't have a problem having and a conversation. But well, you never first. make me lift up 10,000 pounds a conversation. No, listen. I ain't even like, well, no. one time. I'm not expecting no no university conversation. I'm not saying I expect that. So not the quality. But it's just that a general conversation is a back and forth. Thing. Exactly. And if you not well, give me back and forth, it's going to feel like one person. Like, it's it's a one person like, and we're literally talking only because people, people, yeah. I'm asking questions. Yeah. Guys, you say something, them lol. Do this dead ear. If you're not saying something interesting, they will only no. do this. some of no, them. No, exactly. have poor communication. Uh, that is the problem. And the other Half few them, will not be interested, and it goes 50 50. Well, ter- well, 33.3.3.3. Ter- 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 well, I guess why I'm under that set. Remember, female. You know, but you have under that set, we really just the different ways of time. Well, a part of the thing. That we mentioned, I said the in-person impression. Turn-offs can be as silly as the way that someone eats, mm-hmm. laughs, rubs mm-hmm. their palms together, yeah. keep fidgeting, yeah. their, their teeth, yeah. their smell, their walk. Yeah. What am driving? Every yes. single yeah. thing. Right? I, look at it. Oh. I saw she shot in person. I saw she lying in person. I saw she shot. You know what I'm saying? I saw our skin looking in person. Do you remember? Yeah, go buy a little Photoshop picture. Yeah. Or you're going by a little, um, you know, a filtered photo, but we don't want to go too much into that. No, I'm saying even at the picture of filtered, though. No, but even at the picture of Kim, but even at the picture of filtered, doing okay. Even it's like a natural picture, you know. Sometimes you know your appearance different in person. I think we might need to have a part two to this conversation. Hold on, let me tell you. There was this one time I went out with somebody. That you and met online? No, no, no. We know well, <laughs> yes, online and no. Yes, I know. Met them, Jada, knew them first, but then, you know, after I, they were no longer online. Went mm-hmm. out with them, and I went to throw, I'm giving them to throw it out. Like, throw this on me, please. And I'm like, so the garbage bin right here. Exactly. But I'm like, but you're closer to the garbage bin, and I won't go to the bathroom, no. Can you just throw this out so I can just turn and just look to the And I'm like, so he's like, but the garbage bin is right here. And I was like, oh, I'm going to go. Mm-hmm. I jumped there. So I was like, I'm going to go to the bathroom. And then two, you, Jada, definitely. In that situation, Jada is definitely the time waster. Definitely the time waster. One, she going to the bathroom, been in the bathroom. Two, it was right there. It was right but there. But either one of them was Three, <laughs> Either you have to sit in the table and go back to you. No, but it wasn't no table there. So I'm just like, you're closer. Just take it from me so I can just... We're not going to argue over being... Mm, I'm like, that's not work. Turned off that's immediately because then it's going to lead to other things. I just not died. Work. And I was like, no, never mind. How about you want to give me garbage, though? That's not going to work. <laughs> well, one of the most important things as well I want you guys to consider before the first date. Yeah. When meeting a person online, well, from <laughs> the online space, consider safety. 
for the first few meetings, choose public places mm -hmm. and appropriate time of day, eat together and see how the check is being handled, for example, and make sure you go in separate cars. Needless to say, whether you're online or offline, do not provide anything that could be used later to blackmail you. So tell them pictures, where work, voice notes, and them, so. text messages, videos, all of that. So yeah. you have to consider your safety first and foremost. I remember one of the guys before we go to the break, there's a guy that was messaging me. He was, he was like, I just love your energy, your conversation. I can't come by right now. I'm like, come by where? Come by? <laughs> and, and he was so bent. He said he had work at 3. It was like 11 a.m. And he's like, I have work at 3, but I'd love to just come see you. And I said, come see me where? I come to your gate. Just tell me where to come. And he was just bent on it. You know, yeah, you, you just can't come by. I for credit, I can't. If I'm video, I can't. He was just bent. He was like, you know, the conversation was just going so well. I just feel like I need to meet him. I, I don't know how much he will use that work with, but it was not going to fly with me. Easy reports, unmatch uh, them something there because well, it's never add up to me. Well, true. Okay, yeah. You know, no, but, I I when I say rip, how he was bent on no, it, I'm guessing, no, I'm guessing, but no. tell him no, a couple of teams time, and no, mama, still, I, I just want, I just have to. But please, mama, come now. I'm like, why you want to come to my yard? Why is he so bent on that? Yeah, man. So no, because of that intensity, it was just. Yeah. But after the break, we're going to, I like to talk red flags. So that's the next question. What are the red flags you yeah. should watch out for? Any girls that <laughs> wearing a red top or color that's a shade of red top, that's a red flag. We're going to go to the break. When we return, Mine has fantastic. Who are, no, let me call out some people on the live. I see some new names. People. Gummy Fluff, Kin, Kin that, like or that Kind that. that. Kim that Loretta, we have Taj R, we have Colleen Francis, we have Shani Jem, we have Shadi B. Shadi B, large of yourself, yeah. I think kind, I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right, Loretta. I say Loretta in this yeah, book. K I N D A T. Is that Kim that kind at Loretta? She's kind. I don't know. Loretta. So let me yeah, know. Big up in the cell. Yeah. People on the IG, just say something on my because see, Uno. Yeah, because when I yeah. hear your feedback, how yeah. do you feel about online dating? Do you think it's a blessing or a curse? Don't just look, say something. We'll be right back after the break. <laughs> 